Well, hello there. Today we're flying around a Vauxhall Paradise. Off we go! Down we go from the treetops and exploring... Oh my god! No! No! No, bird! No! It's fine. I'm fine. Right, so this is Fugal. Um, a rather lovely little indie game that's just come out. And we're just going to have a bit of a meditative old time. Flapping about the place. See what we can... Oh, hello. What was that? It was a creature. And we just jumped into the... Oh, look! Oak... What is it called? Orca or... Uh, dolphins or something. Uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's absolutely chock-a-full of cool wildlife, this. Look, there were some gulls. Oh, mate, mate. Flap, 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 flap. Let's get going. Ah, there we go. Oh, that's fish jumping out of the water as well. So, yeah, this is a game of relaxation. It really is. Um, you're not going to get shot at. Um, unless the crabs are... Oh, look at him! <laughs> unless the crabs are having their revenge. But no, um, in actual fact, I've actually chosen a little avatar that's a little bit crab-like. You can actually design your own avatar. And which I've done! Uh, which I'm not going to do. I'm actually going to stay here for a bit. I'm going to hover. And have a bit of an old look around. Actually, looks like he's having a right old time there. Let's have a bit of a look. And down we go. That appears to be the edge of the universe. Uh, let's, let's, let's avoid that. Uh, there might be some baddies there. Uh, it's with, with spears. Britney Spears. Oh, look at this. There's, loads, there's people for days over here. Oh, there's like orange Vimto flapping about. Oh, 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 oh. Also, I'm a seagull now. Uh, well, for a while I was anyway. All right. <laughs> uh, less of this lesser black back action. Let's get on with it. And let's see. I think you can actually metamorphosis into anything that you wallop. And by wallop, I mean flap by. Let's try and actually slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. Slow down. Oh, monkeys. Oh, dicks. Well, whatever happened, I am um, apparently now a monkey myself. If we can just get out of this little... Um... Oh, I'm a flappy monkey! Bloody hell, <laughs> it's gone Wizard of Oz. Hello, I'm a flappy monkey today. Oh, dicks. <laughs> oh, I've turned back into... Oh! Lads, I'm, I'm having an identity crisis. Let's get out of here. I'm actually going to press the reset button. Let's get back up into the air. Because that was getting peculiar. Right, let's see what else is out there. I'm back in my crab avatar form. Uh, so this is going to be good for some pilot wings-esque kind of like fly-throughs. Like, there's there's a th fly-through to be had. Yes! Oh, <laughs> that was easier than I expected. I think there must be some ch more challenging holes for me to penetrate. Uh, shut up. <laughs> that was not dirty. Right, let's go through here. Let's poke our way through these little dangly rocks. Peculiar old world, this. Oh, here we go. Gulls, gulls, gulls. Oh, no, they're not. They're, they look like flamingos? Which I think I've turned into... I'm not sure what it is. Oh, no, I'm a green thing. I think this, this world is quite... Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Ha, 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 ha. Ah! I slink back into my normal form. I should be able to get out of this. Although my, um... My crab seems to be a little worse for wear. Uh, let's start again. Back onto the highest trees. Off we go. Oh, look! A, a block. For some reason. <laughs> Not quite. It does appear to be springtime here on the beach of dreams. Oh, hang on. Let's, um, let's see how um, let's see how close to the ground we can get down here. Oh, bloody... <laughs> Ow! Ow. I've got a face full of bark. It's like 3D death chase all over again. All right, come on. Let's have a let's have a look around the bottom of the... Not the bottom of the ocean, but the, the surface... Because I want to find some of these leaping, whatever the hell they were, and see what's up. See if I can actually turn into a fish. Uh, because I've turned into a gull uh, for for reasons. For reasons. Oh! Ah. I think I've had. I think I've taken. Have I put invert on or I've taken invert off? I can't remember. But the con I'm still not 100 with the controls. <laughs> right, go on. Let's. Mm, there we go. Hang on. I don't seem to be going very... Oh, we go. Here we go. There we go. Oh, no. I got me bollocks wet. All right, come on. Let's try and get up a bit higher this time. Oh, here we go. This is... Um, I, can, I can point upwards. Hopefully I won't stall. My little bird engine's stalling. Uh, careful. Careful. Yeah, because it didn't end up going, like, going, jumping off the tall things and going down to the bottom and then staying at the bottom. But for once, let's actually go back up in the air. And see what else... Let's see what actually... See how high you can get. Set the controls for the heart of the sun. 
I said this rem suddenly reminds me of that game I played. The very first Alpha Super did. The Magic Carpet knockoff. Uh, I can't remember what that is now. Uh, whatever happened to that? I think it's still been developed. It was like three years ago now. Uh, anyway, I don't think the sun's getting any closer, is it? I, I can't. Uh, lads. Lads, I'm, I'm, um, I'm above the cloud level, I think. Lads, there's going to be a bird strike. I'm going to hit a 737. Hang on, let's go down. 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 Ah, there we go. Penetrate the skies. Oh, I'm, I'm coming in hot. I'm coming in hot! <laughs> right. Okay, let's have a little bit more of a look around. What, mind the orange tree? Mind the other orange tree? Music is very meditative, as, you'd, as I'm sure you'd expect from a game like this. Okay. Going in much more of a straight line now. Will I reach the edge of the world again? I think I probably will at this rate. I'm going like the clappers here. Uh, oh, 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 getting a bit, getting a bit low there. I wonder if it's generative. Um, I don't know. I didn't really read the instructions. <laughs> I must admit. Well, so far, I mean, um, my experience with it, um, it, it took me a while to actually get started with recording of this, because it did crash out on me a lot. Uh, looking at the Steam forums, there have been a, quite a lot of issues with um, the game not starting up or whatever, so if you are thinking about um, if, if you are thinking about this game, do um, do check <laughs> the forums and things like that, just, and watch out for updates, because it's a little flaky at the moment. Uh, but so far, so good today. Oh, my God! That was not a hole. That was, <laughs> that was just a bit of wall that was lighter than the rest. Uh, lads. Lads? I'm back! Back up on top of the tree. Alright. Let's, let's... Let's have a bit of a final look. I want to turn into something else again. I, I still haven't turned into a bloody fish. There's a fish. I think. That's not a fish. It's close, but no... Cigar fish! Cigar... Ow! Hello, mates. Oh! Oh! I'm that butterfly again. Hello. I wonder if there's actually um, more to the, <laughs> an actual point to this game <laughs> that I've not actually discovered yet. I, reckon, I think there is. I think there's, you're supposed to be able to do certain things, but... Uh, I, I'm, I'm, oh dear. Look at me. Look at me. Actually, don't look at me. I'm hideous. Right, you'll be pleased to know I have read the instructions, and I've actually read the fact that um, this, is, this is actually an early access game, and it should be in, for, um, in that state for about six months. Apparently the devs call this a late alpha at the moment, so there's still plenty to be added to the game. There's already, apparently, like hundreds of, of unique animals to actually find. And yes, it is randomly generated. I wasn't going crazy there. So I'm not quite sure how I actually reached the edge of the world that one time, but I think, um, I think, don't, don't mention that. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so apparently you yeah, have hundreds of... Uh, I want to find some of these other animals now. Um, I think that the trouble is, at the moment, I am just bloody um, going very, very fast indeed and not really taking the time to actually explore. Now, this game is really about exploration and just finding stuff what, and doing things at your own pace. So let's have a bit of a... Let's, let's have a hover. That's not hovering, that's falling onto the bloody water. But now I have shapeshifted into that thing, albeit temporarily. And apparently I think you do actually get maybe like different... Oh no. <laughs> I think I should speed up. Apparently you do get different abilities, I think. Um, you, you can have like absorb abilities temporarily, as well as just the shape. Uh, which is all rather lovely. I think I heard a honk. Ooh, ooh, what are you? What are you, lad? Lad, what are you? Actually, the hovering isn't very... Um, sometimes I keep on just falling down. Here we go, that's more like it. You have to keep on... Oh, yeah. I think you might actually have to keep on help tapping the button. No, it's just... Um, no, that's more like it. Maybe it's just the animal that I, I was wasn't very... Oh, hello. It's the orca again. Oh, no, I'm just... Um, I'm not used to hovering at the moment. It just really doesn't seem to be... Come, come up! Oh, move the camera, move the camera. Oh, bloody hell, I think it's crashed. So, so far, I really like this, um, but it is a frustrating experience having it crash quite a lot. Uh, and also, the controls, um, they're fine. Um, they're fine, you can invert them as much as you want and stuff like that. Um, but I am finding getting out of a jam a bit tricky. When you're, when you're actually, like, crash into something, and you're, it's, it's just a little bit faffy trying to actually get going again. Uh, there's always the reset button, whatever, but I'd like to actually make more of an effort to, you know, get out of the current situation, and, yeah, that could do with a bit of polishing, I feel. Uh, and yes, I mean, if you, if you want a game with a lot of, like, goals and whatever, um, tough. 
And that's not this sort of game at all. Um, but what the hell? I, I really like this sort. Of, I like it when this sort of game exists, and it doesn't need to. Um, <laughs> it doesn't need to be like a shoot 'em up or whatever. This is just fun. But at the moment, as yeah, as I say, because of like um, because of a few issues, it's not quite as um, meditative as it really should be. <laughs> um, but yes, I really do like this. And it does look there are, there, there are like moments of tremendous beauty in this, uh, and I really should uh, quite a bit more often take time to stop and smell the roses or smell the orca. Oh, <laughs> not quite sure what the hell that meant. Oh, come on. Come on, let's get going again. Let's coy on his cat's our way out of here. Actually, there's some serious some, some steam over there. I'm going to park on this bench. Not the... Oh, not bench. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have a little rest on my little monkey beach. Let's have a little bit of a look around. See all my little monkey chums doing their little monkey dance. Oh, a cr tiny little crab! Oh, look at you, look at your tiny little crab. It's, it's basically me, but much smaller. Oh, yeah, the devil really is in the detail in this game. <laughs> it is actually genuinely charming. It's waving! The little monkey pal is waving! Yeah. So, yeah. Oh, he jumped! Oh, this is this is actually a really... <laughs> yeah, this is this is going to take a bit of actually um, me investigating this game a little bit more than I have done in this first impressions. Um, it's really rather lovely. Um, cool. Okay, so we'll stop here. Um, thanks for watching. Um, do subscribe if you want to be notified when new videos about the latest and in most interesting indie games come out. And I shall see you next time. Bye-bye.